Hello and welcome back. <clears throat> Hello and welcome back to Let's Complete Thomas Was Alone. Um, last time we completed levels 2.1 through 2.9, I believe, and we stopped right before uh, level 3.0. Um, we met Claire and John and Chris and Thomas in the last set of episodes. And we're about to meet someone new. I built protections into the system. When overlaps occurred, the world generated a splitter to remove the unwanted additions. It's like a white blood cell. It investigates, it captures, and it removes from play. Hmm. And here we meet... Laura, I believe it is. Laura was pleased this one was behind a wall. Maybe he'd never know what she could do. Maybe, maybe, they could just have a conversation. Hang out. As long as he didn't find out what she could do. Which would never happen, so long as they stayed separate. Laura, Laura's sort of concerned about her ability, I suppose. Um, and that people in the past have, like, taken advantage of her, I believe, is her sort of story. We... Laura didn't have time to worry about the ominous pixel cloud. It had been following her for some time, and it had kept itself to itself until now. More important was the little orange thing, which was looking at her in a way that she kind of, well, liked. Yeah, Laura's thing is she's bouncy, sort of like a trampoline. As the square, who had shyly introduced himself as Chris, bounced atop Laura, she began to worry that he was just using her like all the others had. They'd all bounced too, and then they disappeared when her back was turned. Oh. Not Chris. Chris is nice. Only the ominous pixel cloud ever remained, looking a little bigger and a little less hungry with every disappearing friend. Mm hmm. I wonder what the pixel cloud does. With every bounce, Laura found herself less and less irritated by Chris. She started to miss him when he wasn't there. On another platform or something. Oh. I mean, you haven't been together that long. Come here. There we go. Over here. But yeah, so... Uh, Laura and Chris sort of have this uh, little She'd romance thing. What he was up to? Was he missing her? He wasn't saying very much. Uh, they have this kind of little romance thing going on between them. Oh, that's right. And we can get up. It's kind of cute. Um, kind of adorable, actually. Pixel cloud, though. Chris was in love. She was perfect. He had to tell her so. At some point, he would definitely tell her. Probably best to wait for a moment the large, ominous pixel cloud wasn't about, though. Yeah. Yeah. Probably best to wait. I need him. I forgot. That's what I actually needed him for, was to get Laura over. Now, 
I'm not entirely sure the best way to do this. I think perhaps the best way, though it might take a while, is to sort of just adjust between them as they make their way over. Uh, but yeah, um, Laura's really cool. Um, like I said, I'll probably say that they're all my favorites, but, you know, I do really like Laura and Chris, uh, especially together. Um, I think it's kind of interesting that, uh, Mike Bithel decided to have a little romance between his, you know, tiny little quadrilaterals for whatever reason. Um, yeah, Laura's kind of like the shy unassertive one that everything seems to go wrong for. People use her and leave her. Um, she's you know, always followed by this thing that makes people you know, not want to be around her a lot. We, we all knew people like that you know, like in high school who just had something about them that made no one want to hang out with them ever. And uh, you know, they were always kind of alone and sad. But, um, sometimes, like I guess with Chris and Laura, they found just the right person who didn't, you know, just use them to use them, didn't care about their faults, like Laura's pixel cloud. Yeah, it's good. Um, again, I, I, I really do love this game and uh, Mike Bithell's little creations here. There we go! Coming. Woo! Okay, what do I need to do here? Uh, you. Oh, darn it, I got Thomas. Go away. There we go. Chris was massively disappointed to run into the gang again. He enjoyed the alone time with his new girlfriend. Chris is now disappointed that everybody else showed up. Sort of ruined his date with Laura. Come on, Chris. Was it too early to refer to Laura as his girlfriend? Only if I say it out loud, he told himself. He didn't want to scare her off. Don't worry, Chris. Laura likes you too. Ooh, come on. Up, up. Now Chris. Now Thomas. No, it's not too early, Chris. The others seem suspicious of Laura and the eager looking pixel cloud of death which seemed to be watching her. Sure, they'd use her inherent bounciness to reach slightly higher jump points, but they wouldn't strike up a conversation with her. Chris found them rude. Indeed. Rude? And always there. <laughs> Getting in his way! It's like when you have those, you know, that just... Those couple of friends that won't leave. No matter, you know, all the hints you give. You're in the room. It's just you and your girlfriend. And you're like, hey, yeah, you know, um, it, you, you can go, you know, hang out with uh, those other friends. It's like, but I'm already here. I, I want to hang out here. But, but, but yeah, but, um, y you know, uh, we, we got some studying to do. Oh, oh, yeah, I'd like to study with you. Yeah, yeah, I, I need some help in that class. You just want to yell at them to leave. I'm trying to be alone with a girl or a guy. I don't judge. Don't judge. I'm trying to be alone with this person. Just, just go away. 
Go away, please. Oh, God. I always forget how this one works properly. The others wouldn't drop it. Who's that cloud guy? Why is he following us? What's that rumbling hungry sound he keeps making? Chris, can we just leave Laura behind? <laughs> oh, I like that voice. I don't, I don't remember how this one's supposed to work. We go up. We jump over to this one. Nope. God. No, no, no. Crush. Come on, there we go. Okay, we get over here. We go up. Jump here. And then wait to get up here. Okay. Rude. Indeed. Indeed, Chris. Okay, and we have that thing now. Which does what? We get on it. Oh, I think we have to get everyone up here, don't we? Yeah, okay, so we have to help Laura get up. Darn it! I should have left them up there. Oh, how much help does Laura need to get up to the thing? Oh, she doesn't need any help. Okay. Well, I screwed that up. We'll send Laura up first, I think. Nope, don't fall. I I've never understood, just for some reason, some of them will just, like, fall off these blocks. A and I don't know if that's a glitch or intentional, but I never seem to, like, properly stop it, and it makes these levels just much harder than they probably should be. Come on. Down. Up. Okay, now we want over on this one. Oh, we can't even get up there by ourselves. Oh, no. Yep, because we go up. Okay, there we go. Now we can't get up there by ourselves, though. Um, Chris. Come on. Off you go. Okay. Come on, Chris. Over there. Over. Okay, no, Thomas. Nope, nope, no, no, missed. We go up, 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 up. But yeah, um, and, and and again, I think I said this last time, but, but it is very interesting how much, um, sort of, you know, Mike Bithel can make me care about his characters in this, darn it, in this game. Um, despite the fact that they're, you know, little square, square people, um, who, you know, aren't human any other way except, you know, how they talk about themselves or about stuff. Oh, no, 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 That was almost bad. Okay. So, let's stack ourselves. Can Laura get up this? Onto that? No. Okay, how are we supposed to do this then? Okay, Laura can jump straight up onto there, so if we do this. There we go. Now we can hop on, I think. Okay, good, good. I think everyone else can make that jump by themselves. There we go. Yep. Nope, nope, screw it up. Get on there. Go up. Over. Get on Sean. Oop, oop, oop. Now come on, there we go. And now we got Claire again. 
Hooray, Claire! Up. Press that. Get back. Um, how is this going to work? Uh, okay, so yeah, we now need to send Chris up into here. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem to be sticking around. Well, I screwed it up. Okay, so I need to get Laura on there quickly. As soon as Chris is out. Essentially. Or as soon as I get Chris up to the top bit, I need to get Laura on to Laura liked Claire. her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem to be sticking around too. Not like those losers from before. Indeed. Okay. Now what's the deal? We need to bounce him on there. Hit the button. Oh, 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 come on, come on, come on. Ah. Yeah, this one's a bit difficult, isn't it? Um, okay, so... Chris, you're gonna be in the middle. Thomas, you're gonna be sort of right next to him. Okay, Chris, you get up here. Laura liked her new gang. She liked Chris. She liked having friends. These ones seem to be sticking around, too. Not like those losers from before. Okay, I think that'll work. We're gonna go ahead and move... Claire over just a bit. Send him up to take care of this. Okay, so how are we supposed to do this? I think we need to get Laura on. John. Come here. Okay. Move Thomas over here, or over just a little bit. Chris can now jump up here, on here, and then up. Same thing with Thomas. Thomas can come here, here, up. Uh, Claire can go over here. Laura can go back to where she was. And John can go up here. And um, I'll call it there for this episode. Uh, we'll continue next time. Uh, thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, uh, please like and subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you all next time.